Earlier today, I was on Tuesday night's main event. Thank you for everyone who stopped by to watch. Um, I'm really happy that they invited me back on. I thought they hate me. And uh, yeah, um, it's actually pretty cool. But they said that Matt Walsh came out with a trailer for a movie or a documentary. I'm not 100% sure. And I do want to check it out. And uh, I guess the title of the movie is called Am I Racist? Official trailer from Matt Walsh. Um, here, here it is, Matt Walsh. I know you don't need my subscription. If this trailer is funny or is entertaining anyway, I'll hit subscribe. And I'll hit like. All right? Deal? Matt Walsh? All right, let's go. Let's watch. Just check this out. Let's check this out. Go. Let's be clear what's happening in this country. It's Nazism. Republicans are Nazis. You cannot separate yourselves from the bad white people. No way. That's how... Oh, my God. Oh, my God, man. And you wonder why Donald Trump got shot in the past eight years now people are saying that he's worse than hitler he's the worst thing that's ever happened and there you don't think that there's going to be bad actors out there who literally believes that and now people uh, people are saying republicans are racist republicans are nazis republicans are white supremacists and stuff like that and and you know the fact that you have larry elder you know from here in here in california basically being called the black face of white supremacy it's mind-boggling these people are st still walking i'm surprised they don't fall down more often holy crap man Growing up in the 90s, I never thought much about race. Sure, you noticed, but never really seemed to matter that much. At least not to me. Being a white, straight, cisgender man, it's the top of the pile. I'm on the top of the pile. That's me. Am I racist? I would really appreciate it if you left. I'm trying to learn. I'm on this journey. Can you please? Okay, so this looks like a documentary kind of thing, similar to What is a Woman? Uh, Matt Walsh, that, that, that documentary is great. So the thing is that whenever you challenge these crazy lunatics, these woke people, whenever you challenge them, they immediately, because they're all NPCs. Like, like I said, they're all NPCs. Whenever you exhaust their dialogue, they just repeat the last thing they said over and over again. And they just call you a racist and they'll tell you to leave. It's because they cannot talk to you. They don't know how to function. When you give them logic, they fucking malfunction. That's everyone. Every one of them. You give them actual proof source when you give them the proof when you give them the source they're like that's fake that that's a deep fake it's so dumb it oh it's so dumb please leave i'm gonna sort this out i need to go deeper undercover if i want to be an ally i need Do to it. look like one Oh no, he's the guy from, uh, he's playing his character from Lady Ballers. What is racism? Martin Luther King said not to judge people by the- Martin Luther King said a lot of stuff. Is America- Martin Luther King said a lot of stuff. They oh, it's funny that these liberals always use Martin Luther King. I have a dream that one day my dick will be huge, right? They always bring up Martin Luther King. And, then, and whenever you give Martin Luther King, you actually directly quote that, you know, my, my kids will be living in a world that's to be judged on the contents of their character, but not the color of their skin, right? When you give them that quote, it's like, actually, actually, this is what he actually said. <laughs> Inherently racist. What the hell is that? The word inherent is challenging there. America is racist to its bones. Yeah. All of the so inherently. Yeah. The entire system has to burn. And I'm not going to even use save this country. This country is not worth saving. This country is a piece of shit. Oh, sorry. Sorry. They gonna say I'm racist. Joining us now is Matt, certified DEI expert. Here's my certification. Where are you guys on your anti-racist journeys? <laughs> so look around the room and point to who we believe is the most racist person in the room. We want to wow. rename the George Washington Monument to the George Floyd Monument. Would you mind signing it? You oh my God, man. I'm surprised I haven't done that yet. 
I'm surprised when Obama took office, they didn't rename the White House the Black House. I, like, I, yo, chat, just letting you know, if, if somehow I become president, like, I, 100%, I will paint the, the White House yellow. I'll call it the Yellow House. Hey, welcome to United States of America. Welcome to the Yellow House. Make sure you take off your shoe before you enter, please. A crawl around with your fucking knees. What do you think about this issue of heteronormativity and how it intersects with the broader structures of racism in society? Oh. Say I'm What's up with white people? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing to decenter your whiteness? Who's making it the center? Why are they doing that? And what you're doing is you're stretching out of your whiteness. Listen more for you in this field. <laughs> white folks. White trash. White supremacy. White woman. White boy. White entitlement. White. Centering. White silence. Is there a black person around here? There's a black person right here. Does he not exist? Oh my God, dude. Racist. Hi, Robin. Hi. It's going to be good, man. And what's your name? I'm Matt. Matt. Hi, yeah. Matt. <laughs> nice to meet you. I just had to ask who you are because you have to be careful. Oh, man. Sem September 13 on Daily Wire Plus. We I am subscribed. I, I am subscribed to Daily Wire Plus. All right, all right. You you intrigued me there, Mr. Walsh. Given given what you said about video games and anime, this is intriguing. You have got a subscriber right now. I'm not gonna hit notification notification bell though. You didn't get me that hard. You got me a little bit hard. Just a little bit. Not full candy corn, just half candy corn. All right. But going back to the video. Uh, the fact that it said that white people, white people are bad, white people are this, white people are that, saying bad stuff about white people. Kamala Khan, AOC. Oh man, oh, uh, all of these crazy politicians that hate white people are dating or married to a white person. Ain't that funny? Ain't Ain't that funny though? Like the people that they say that they hate the most, that's a problem, problem with America are the white people. And then all of them date white people, right? Don Lemon they, they are married, a, dating or married a, a white man, right? It's just those dang hypocrites, man. Yeah, Ilhan O. Yeah, Ilhan Omar. Isn't Ilhan Omar dating uh, her brother? 